So a lot of you might have heard about the game that began trending in January, where we have to journey the depths of our vocabulary to randomly guess five letter words. Well, today we're playing just that. What is up, everyone? Welcome back to HGT Entertainment, and today we're playing today's Wordle, Dordle, and Quartle. All right, let's start things off with today's Wordle, and our first word today is plant. No, plain. Let's try that. All right, so we have an A and the N, and they're placed in different spots than what we're given here, so. How about angst? Let's see what that does for us. Okay, so they're in different spots than those. And let's see, what can we do here? Okay, so the A and the N might be separated. So if that's the case, then it'll probably be either N something A or A or something A something N. Or maybe the end might be at the beginning, or at the end. Let's see here. How about Cairn? Let's try that. Okay, so the A is in the correct position, and we have an R and an N that are in the incorrect position. So the end has to go at the beginning, or it has to go in the middle somewhere. So if it was going in the middle, might be Randy. That's what I'm thinking. Let's try that. Okay, so the N is in the, cor in the, in the correct spot. The R is going to be at the end. Hmm. Manor would be good. That's the only thing I can think of, so let's give it, let's give it a shot. And it was Manor. Look at that. All right. So that was today's Wordle Word. Let's move on to Dordle. All right, so this is Daily Dordle 127. So let's get started with chair. And okay, so we have an A, C, and an H in our first letter, first word. And it'll probably be something, the C and the H will probably be together. So it'll probably be might be something A and then something CH. That's what I'm thinking. Latch or something ATCH would be pretty good. So let's let's give that a shot. Okay, so the C and the H are not at the end. The H is at the end in the second word though. So if the H is in the, at the end in the second word, it'll probably be, well it can't be CH because there's no C. But it'll probably be something SH, PH, or GH. There's no T, because if there was a T, I would do thigh. But then again, the H is not in that position. So let's see, where can this I go? The I could either, it, it's probably gonna go in one of these first two, or it might be in the third. I, you, you just don't know, I don't know, I don't know yet. So. Hmm, maybe it's H-A for the first word, and then a C. Hacks? I mean, let's try that. It, it brings in some more letters, so let's give it a shot. Okay, so we have the C in the correct spot, so it's gonna be something A-C-H for the first word. Uh, let's see here. Okay, so back to the first word. It's probably gonna be A-C-H and the letters. I see macho and that might work. Let's try it. Okay, so it's, we have an A-C and H and O and we don't know the last letter yet or the first letter yet. So I don't know yet. Let's just, for the second word, let's try a test word that we know is not gonna be it, but test for the I, S, and H. So let's go with fish and see what we get. Okay, so we have an I, S, and an H. And... It's probably gonna be... There's probably gonna be another vowel. Probably gonna be like a U. Probably gonna have a U there. That was the case. 
Hmm. Oh, okay, so... The first word is probably going to be nacho. I don't see anything else. Let's try it. And it's nacho. All right. So all we have to worry about is the final word here. And let's see. Might be an E. So maybe something E-I-S-H? What could it be? Okay, so swish is a definite possibility. The only problem I see here is that it's a double letter, but you never know what Dordle's gonna pick, so I think this is the only thing I see. Let's try it. It was Swish. All right, so we got Nacho and Swish for Daily Dordle. That was really close. All right, so let's move on to the Quartal. All right, so here we are at the Quartal. This is four words we have to guess at once, and we're given nine guesses. So we're given two more guesses, but two more words. So that seems reasonable. Okay, let's go with, hmm, let's go with grind and see what we get. Ooh, all right, so we have the G and the R in the second word already, locked in place. So that's probably gonna be G-R and then followed by a vowel, so maybe great? Ooh, it's not great, but we do have more letters, so it could be like grave or grape or grays even, so I don't want to try and guess any of those words right now, so we have nothing in the first word here, so let's see. So the final word has an I, so I think the best we can do from here is just continue guessing words, so let's go with climb, see what we get. All right, so we have all, yeah, we do have all the letters in the third word, so what would that be? This is gonna be some sort of, like we are gonna have to anagram it, so let's see, I-D-E-G-M, hmm, D-I, Oh, Midge. Yeah, let's try that. And it is Midge. All right, so we have three more words, five more guesses. So, and we have the E there, which we predicted in the second word. So, still, it could either be Grave, Grays, or Grape. We have, we don't know yet, so. Okay, so this last word might be IC, and if that's the case, might follow with a K or H. So, let's see, hmm. Which would be good, but the only thing is it's that double letter again, but it's the only thing I can think of at the moment. Let's try it. Ooh, it's not which, and there's no H or W. So, we have the I and the C in the locked position, in the correct position, and we have the L and the C in their correct positions. So the L and the C are there. Then it's probably gonna be something like flock, maybe? Or let's try that. Ooh, okay, so we have the L, the C, and the K. And we have three words left and three guesses left. So we're gonna have to guess every every word here, which is gonna it's gonna be kind of a long shot. But it's probably gonna be pluck. Let's think about this. What else could it be? I don't think sluck's a word, is it? No, it's not a word. Hmm. It could be cluck, but, oh wait, it can't be because that yellow C. Yeah, I think it's pluck, so let's try it. It's pluck, all right, so. And there's no P over here, so we just have grave or graze. Hmm, maybe we'll get a clue from this final word here. The U's either gonna go, these are, it's gonna be something U-I-C, or maybe something U and then I-C. I don't see anything that it could be U something I-C, so it might be Q-U-I-C, but then what would come after the uh, C? Cause it can't be a K. No, oh. Oh yeah, so juicy would work. It's the only thing I can think of, so let's try it. 
It's juicy. Okay, so hmm, we have one final guess here, and it it's it's one or the other, guys. We we know it's gonna be something G R A something E, and it's either grave or grays. So it it comes down to like a fifty fifty here. Hmm. Which one should I do? It's which one is like gonna be probably more common? Maybe it's grave or grays. Hmm. I have no idea what Cordal would pick, so. Oh, this is so difficult. Uh, I should have done something with those letters earlier on, and maybe I would have been able to solve it in nine. Maybe I'll solve it in nine now, but. Okay, let's, let's try Graves, see what we get. Oh my gosh, it was Graves. Man, that was luck right there. I mean, it could have been Grace. It could have been Grace. Wow. Whew. Well, that was today's Quartal. All right, well, those were today's Wordle, Dordle, and Quartal. Let me know how you did in those today. Don't forget to subscribe, like the video, turn on notifications, and comment down below how you did on these today and what other Wordle-like games I should try. All right, that's it from here. Stay HDT-tastic.